lawsuit seeking to strike down the Affordable Care Act. Instead, the president should urge the 14 states who have refused to expand Medicaid to do so. Today, House Democrats are unveiling the Take Responsibility for Workers and Families Act, a bill that takes responsibility for the health, wages, and well-being of America's workers. Okay, Mr. Gutfeld, I think everybody knows the relief package isn't going to be perfect. I'd like to see a little bit more money in there for workers, maybe twice as much for families. But I don't see anything wrong with having strings attached for, you know, no stock buybacks, no bonuses. But for attaching strings to things like making sure there's more women on corporate boards or new Green New Deal issues, that's fine. But that's not what this is about. You know, there are two things. One, to your point, does it have to be perfect? We're not in a time of luxury where you can hone this package to an ideal thing. You know, when a firefighter is facing a blaze, does he stop and go, hey, uh, excuse me, is that mineral or tap water? <laughs> no. He gets that hose and he points it at the fire. This package, this relief package, is the hose, the water that we need. But the bigger problem, though, is that no, I consider myself a layperson. I have no idea what's wrong with this bill. Ideological language obscures the truth so that the lay people cannot see what's going on. So it's like we need a visual model to show us what these bones of contention are. What are the absurdities and what aren't the absurdities? A chart, a graph, a doll, where you can say, this is where they disagree, this is where they don't. But instead, you know, we just see how politics undermines everything. I mean, oddly, politics is the invisible virus that's gonna beat us. It's not going to be the coronavirus, because if this keeps us from getting the stimulus or the relief package for the economy, then we're all screwed. So it's, it, you know what? We are asked, as, as Americans, to sacrifice. We're told to stay in our homes and not go to work. Then they should do their effing job. They should be, stop playing this stupid game and match our sacrifice, or else they've forgotten us as citizens. It is amazing, Juan, how the whole